Good morning, Pioneers. It's that time again when the WPKN Live gives you the information for the day from the Media Center. Today is Wednesday, January 19th, 2022. I'm Bruce Teague. Now let's all stand and join Nayeli Sanchez for the Pledge of Allegiance. Nayeli? Good morning, Pioneers. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may be seated. Now back to our anchor. Well done, Nayeli. Now let's stand and join, Spen- now let's join Spencer, who is in the WPKN weather studio for a check on the weather. Spencer? Good morning, Pioneers. Today's weather will be sunny with a 5% chance of rain. The wind will be blowing out of the southeast at 5 miles per hour. The high today will be 72 with a low of 45. Have a great day. Now back to our anchor. Thank you, Spencer, for that informational weather update. For lunch today, our incredible Romeo chefs are preparing for us a choice of tacos or a wow butter sandwich and panto beans and fresh fruit. Don't forget your choice milk. Now here's Miss Finnewald and Miss Williams with today's Pioneer Minutes. Good morning, Miss Finnewald and Miss Williams. Good morning, Bruce. Good morning, Miss Finnewald. Good morning. Good morning, boys and girls. I hope you are having a wonderful Wednesday. I know it is not so wonderfully cold outside. So boys and girls, if you go out of your classroom, please take your time and put your jackets on. I believe Miss Williams and Miss Finnewall are still frozen yes. Yes. from car duty. All right, Miss Finnewall, let's hear about these buses. Great news this morning. A wonderful way to start Wednesday. All of our buses are on the board this morning and all of our buses arrived on time. So it is a fantastic day. Good job, boys and girls. And I'm going to ask that you carry that onto this campus, bus riders and car riders alike. Boys and girls, did you know that you have the power? You possess the power to make Romeo a better place. You can lead by example. You can show all of our new students and some of our remind our other students of our pioneer expectations being responsible being respectful being safe and being leaders let's talk about leading you can lead by example let's say a group of people are doing what something they really shouldn't be they're being disrespectful maybe they're talking um, in an unkind way Did you know it's your responsibility as a leader, as a pioneer, to look at that person and go, stop. We don't do that at Romeo. If that person continues on because they want to make you laugh or they want to feel big and bad or I am so funny, you ignore them. Withdraw that attention. Just turn away. Because what they want is your attention. Do not throw gas on that fire and encourage that inappropriate behavior. You have the power to stop it. Finally, if you've asked them to stop, you've ignored, and they continue, you go to an adult. And we will help you. Because, boys and girls, we need you to help us make Romeo a better place to learn and grow. So, use that power and do what's right. All right, let's celebrate some reflex math. In Miss Chambers' class, we have Cesar Tolentino with with 2,000 total facts solved in multiplication and division. Braden Ledford, 2,000 facts solved. Isaiah LaBelle, 2,000 facts solved. Evelyn Alonzo Perez, 2,000 facts solved. David Soto, 3,000 facts solved. Alessandra Yanez, 3,000 facts solved. Aubrey Ritchie, 3,000 facts. Jason Lopez Herrera, Herate, 3,000 facts solved. Juliet Benitez, 4,000 facts solved. Allison Guerrero, 4,000 facts solved. We have Patsy Saucedo Cano, 5,000. Let me go back. Ramiro Guerrero, 4,000 facts solved. Jeffrey Hernandez Lopez, 5,000. Susie Valor, Valley, five total green lights. Eamon Hick, Ethan Hicks, five total green lights. Ethan Hoyt, five total green lights. Haley Holcomb, five total green lights. Evelyn Alonzo Perez, 
10 total green light days. Jeffrey Hernandez Lopez, 20 total green light days. Aubrey Ritchie, 10 green light days. Celeste Smith, 10 green light days. Olivia Weekly, 10 green light days. Nikel Williams, you are 60% fluent. Kate Lopez, 70% fluent. Elizandra Yanez, 90% fluid. Fluent. Boys and girls, congratulations. Hard work pays off. I am super proud of you. All right, Miss Finnewall, what do you know? What well, else do we have? I, just a reminder that our, our word of the month is respect, just understanding that someone or something is important and should be treated in an, in an appropriate way, just like you talked about, Miss Williams, leading by example, being respectful, all great qualities. All right, one more thing before we get to our words of wisdom. Teachers, MTSS, to the best of your ability. Got that? To the best of your ability. Follow your contingency plan. Let's get those scripted programs done as, again, as much as humanly possible. All right, here we go, boys and girls, on to some words of wisdom. As a young person, Dr. King, Martin Luther King, remember Monday we were off of school to honor him and his accomplishments and contributions to our society. As a young person, Dr. King was an excellent student who studied hard. He loved learning. His love for learning made him a great teacher and minister. He taught the world by way of his example. He taught fairness, courage, and nonviolence. In honor of his birthday, let's remember his famous words spoken at the historical March on Washington in 1963. He said, I have a dream that one day in the Red Hills of Georgia, the sons of former slaves and the sons of former slave owners will be able to sit down together at the table of brotherhood. The best way we can honor this great man, this great man is and the hard work he did for people everywhere is to respect one another. Man, we were on it today, I weren't know. we? I promise I did not read this in <laughs> advance. Today, be kind and respectful to one another. You have the power, Romeo, and the choice is yours. Make it a great day. Good. Well, thank you, Miss Finnewald and Miss Williams. Well, that's all for today, Pioneers. Thanks for watching WPKN this morning. Be sure to join us again tomorrow for the news that kids can count on to start their day. I'm Bruce Teague. Until next time, see you later. Bye for now.